All right. Welcome back to Endless Mode. We're going to leave the alley of broken dreams and no money. And go to the metro entrance, apparently. Ricky if arrives you... at a metro station and decides to take a look inside. But what if I don't? Don't want to leave those behind. Just in case it has some reason to backtrack. Yeah. Can you go in the hole? Probably. I think that's where it wants me to go. Uh oh. Icy finds another strange box. I think those gave you a power up. Icy discovers that she can now easily pass through steel bars. Me. Icy resumes her journey, following the arrow to the left. Uh, but I want to. You know what? Icy ignores the arrow. She doesn't notice the disturbing feeling hanging in the air. Oh, you can pass through those bars. That's a ladder. That oh. One. Yeah. Being a good robot. Are you? You're, you're sticking with it? Yes. But man, I don't want to be a good robot. <laughs> oh, good. Spider bot. Alright, come on. Well, at least you know you can beat him. I mean, it's just him. He isn't the fourth or fifth wave. Oh, jerk. Parker's lost heart. Oh? A dead end? I wonder if that was a Peter That's Parker right. reference. There shouldn't be a dead end here. Well, there should be that's... a. Follow the arrow, he says. It leads to a thing. Uh. I feel like you're making this up as you go along. continues to look deeper into the tunnels. Icy sets off all the explosives. <laughs> With her face. Oh. Those could pop up as enemies without the uh, the big one. Oh, neat. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's funny that we probably won't see a new enemy type for a <laughs> while now after that boss rush. Probably not. I didn't see any arrows, did you? I did not. Get that money. Certainly not what I expected when we started this game. <laughs> and that's not even like a criticism or anything, it's just like... Just not what we expected. Yeah. Ooh. 
Icy follows the okay. arrow. She knows that she will find Judas soon. Icy attempts to explore the area, but there's nothing of interest in that direction. Icy should go back and follow the arrow. <sighs> but I'm it's, sure there is. It's such a condescending tone. I wonder if you, uh, I wonder if you beat this, uh, this way, if it's like, well, that's the demo of the game. <laughs> like, if it's super straightforward and, like, if Judas really is right at the end in, like, the next room or something. That'd be funny. Ten-year development cycle. Well, that's typically what independent metroidvanias cost. It's certainly not the first nor the last 10 year development cycle on one of these. Yeah. I was say, somebody did an article not too long ago uh, talking about their 8 year dev cycle on a game. Yeah. They're very tongue in cheek about it. I, I appreciated their their candor and ability to like you know laugh at the situation probably helped that they actually did finish the game though oh yeah weird secret areas. No, I wonder what the little drone guy that's following me is for. Yeah. He hasn't really been given any explanation and he doesn't seem to do anything. He's just sort of... He's your little buddy. Yeah, Reminds me of the things that followed you around in uh, Fantasy Star Online. Yeah. Visuals are really nice on this game. Mm -hmm. I was just thinking, it seems like the kind of game that would have a mini map, except for the fact that the storytelling prohibits it. Yeah. Like Old versions this... of it did have a mini map. What's that? Old versions of it did have a mini map. Really? Yeah, you saw it in the prototype. Oh. Archive. So yeah, if this game is if this if this game is what it said on the tin, it would definitely have a map system. Mm -hmm. I see here's a roar coming from the depths of the cave to her right. And immediately goes to spend all of their money. Yeah. Oh yeah, 
it's Carlos. Not the name I would have probably given this guy, but, uh, you know, whatever. He's part car. <laughs> Ouch. Jerk. Jerk. Okay. He seems a little feistier than the other one. Although it could just be that he's got a bigger arena. Yeah. Ran out of the health. Well, it saved all your buying habits. You don't have That's to buy true. everything at least. I don't remember him doing that move in the boss rush, you know? Yeah, maybe you just didn't get a chance. Maybe. Because he did the move with the front leggies, and he tromped you a couple times, but that was about it. Way back in. Another challenge defeated. Icy continues to the exit on the right. Nothing fancy to say for that. <laughs> uh, Icy enters a metro car in total disrepair, but it seems like it could still be operated. The metro you seem begins sure to move, of that. and yeah. Icy is hurled towards her destiny, awaiting at the clock tower. I got put on literal railroad tracks. Yep. I mean, I, I always have thought it would be funny to play a game that was literally on rails. <laughs> but. Well, there we go. Icy leaves the metro, following the arrow to Judas's hideout, the clock tower. But, but. This sounds like final level music. It does. Hello! Oh! Haven't seen you guys since the boss rush. Hi! That means that he gets introduced with a, a regular Thor. Uh, yeah. That bit of the boss arch was functioning as intended, I guess. <laughs> All right. I think it's a nice touch that you pop their noggins off. Yeah. Got really tall ceilings. Yeah. Heck of a heck of a skybox, I think. Okay. Oh. Icy enters the clock tower, a place once rich with science and technology, now nothing more than a desolate hideout for Judas, the mass murderer. Icy arrives in the dining room, barren and empty. 
Some scraps from dinners, never finished, lay scattered on the tables. Okay. Are you hungry? You found a room. There's nothing to eat here. Just exploring the clock tower, dude. Relax. Plus, it's not like he told us where to go. Yeah, I think I saw some arrows. I see, to her surprise, that this room is much like the forest from earlier. Everything is fine, as long as I did, keep did following the arrow. Did we just wrap around to the beginning of the game? I lapped myself. Oh! Yeah, got some new enemies, though. <laughs> So I just thought of a way that those uh, dual core guys could be worse. After you beat them, they split apart into the two oh, regular ones. that would ones. be pretty bad, yeah. That seems like the kind of fight extending thing that somebody could do in a, a game. A road paved with death lies ahead of Icy. She follows the arrows and leaves Open this room. Door. Next time I'm in this mode, I'm gonna follow the arrows like a good Icy robot. <laughs> This truly is the way of death.